what is up guys it's the scripting legend here and today i am back doing another how to video for roblox scripting today i am going to be showing you how to make your very own team spawn i mean team change gui so um before we get started i just want to say guys um Please remember to subscribe. 75% of you guys who watch this are not subscribed to the channel. It really helps with upcoming videos and I'll really appreciate it guys. So remember to do that now. Alright. Alright, so let's get into it. First thing we're gonna want to do is go into the model tab and just insert a spawn location. Actually insert two spawn locations. You can um rename one to police spawn and you can set the team color um the team color will be lapis uh and then just um put neutral to false in force field duration to zero and now i'm um, going to the other spawn location set the team color to uh let's do deep orange i guess set the force field duration to zero and leave neutral on t true and um yeah let's do it here we'll just um set the brick color to deep orange as well and the other one's brick color to lapis so we know which spawn is which all right and now let's um go into the starter gui and insert a screen gui and we can rename it to team spawn i mean team change I don't know why it keeps playing team spawn guys um all right so we can just insert a, a text button you can make the size to whatever you want it to be so just whatever you want it to be just make it like that I'm not gonna worry too much about looks I'm not gonna worry at all about looks in this video but um you guys make it look nice um here we'll just actually make this one the prisoner one uh, so we can rename it to change to prisoner prisoner all right and then we go down its properties put text scale to true font to source is hands bold text color to white and texture of transparency to zero can make it say um become a prisoner prisoner here let's just actually insert a frame into the team change and we'll just make the size to one comma zero comma one comma zero then just put the transparency the background transparency to one and just make the parent of the change to prisoner gui to frame to the frame all right so now if we just make the frame visible to false it will make the other thing visible to false and um now inside of the change prisoner we can insert a script a regular script not a local script and um we can do whoops we can do local player is equal to script dot parent dot parent dot parent so right now we start at the script's parent which is the change the prisoner then we go to the frame then the team change UI, so we need to add one more dot parent and actually one more dot parent. Alright, so just copy that down. Then we can do um script dot parent dot mouse but one click colon connect function function. Then we can um then we'll do a uh, vocal character is equal to workspace then um square brackets player and then we'll do um character colon find first actually here we'll do local humanoid is equal to character colon find first child and then we'll do humanoid all right and um now we can do humanoid dot health is equal to zero 
All right, so now that's now we can just hide our UIs and let's um go over to the model tab. Click on these like two like wheels here. Just click on that. If you hover your mouse over, it should say service. So just click on that. Window should appear right about here. There should be two things: replicate the script service and teams. So click on the teams and then click insert. And then now you should have this team service in the Explorer. So now inside of the teams, we can insert a team and we can call it um, prisoners. And we can set the team color to deep orange, duplicate it, name it to police, and um, team color to La Peace and just um check auto assignable to false now we can put our ui back on and go back into the script and we can do player dot teams dot um player dot team is equal to teams oh wait player dot teams is equal to player dot teams dot dot prisoners all right so now we can um duplicate this the um button and we can drag it over to here you can change the background color to blue and we can change the text to become a police police and we can re rename it to change to police And then we'll um, we'll just do uh wait right here we have to do player dot team 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 yeah just leave it how we had dot teams equals to player dot teams dot police all right then um should work now oh here let's just um make it hide the frame when you click it so we'll do um script dot parent dot parent dot visible is equal to false and we'll just put that in the other one too script dot parent dot parent dot visible is equal to the visible is equal to false all right so now let's go ahead and play this Okay, so I'm on the prisoner's team. If I click on become police, and we have an error. Local character is equal to, um, here. We'll do is equal to player dot character. 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 All right, and now let's try this again. Click on become a police. All right, see that's what I was thinking. All right, so we have to do player dot team color is equal to um uh what's um the name of this police spawn is equal to police is equal to game dot workspace dot police spawn dot brick color. All right. Then let's just um copy this script here. And then just paste it into the prisoner script and we'll do just um we'll do prisoner spawn here instead. Prisoner spawn. Alright, now let's play this. Okay, hit become a police officer and I am uh, I'm on the police team now. Okay. So if I just kill myself. And I'm here. Now if I want to become a prisoner. Oh, oops, we spelled it wrong. We have to, oh, it's just called spawn location, that's why. I'll just rename the spawn location to prisoner spawn, prisoner spawn, 
prisoner spawn. All right, and now if we play this, it should work. Okay, so if we're here, we want to become police. Change. We're now on the police team. Up here, you can see. Spawn at the police side here. It become a prisoner. Same thing happens. I'm back on the prisoners team. And I'm going to become a police once again. Alright, so it works. Alright, guys. Well, that's going to be it for today's video. If you enjoyed and this helped you out, please remember to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.